sarcastic, prophetic words of George Simonet. You're going to have to bear with me a bit. This is going to be a little bit of a dive. But it's going to make sense when we get out on the other side. In 1953, George Simonet sang a song called Run Joe Run. And for as many times as I've heard it, I always thought it was just a fun dancing song. It starts with the verse. <laughs> But here's the thing. Money from sponging did eventually end. In fact, decades before this song was even written, each verse talks about another industry that was supposed to be a sure thing to bring money in but failed. A couple years ago, I realized that this wasn't a dancing song. This was old George speaking from the grave about the fleeting nature of money and these industries and the problem of relying heavily on one industry, which brings us to the next verse. Oh boy, go down to the park. Go boy, boy, get, get Taurus money. Taurus money never done. Taurus money. Taurus money is a lot of fun. Taurus money. Taurus money will never done. You got tourist money. In 1953, he could see the eventual demise of the tourism industry, that it would go the same way of sponging and siso. So why in 2020 are we waiting eagerly for its return? Even if it comes back, it will never be the same. We don't even know if cruise ships are ever going to be able to recover from this. Now is the time for us to figure another way out. Yes, it is great that the local economy has some activity, but we still need to get money into the country and a way to make our nation more food secure. And I'm sure that in the coming weeks, we will hear something from the government. But if the past week has taught you anything, it is that sometimes we have to lead the government to the right solution. They just need to write it down on paper. So what can we do, don't say oil or tourism, to bring money and resources that we need into the country. Sorry, I didn't mean to make it so intense. As the young kids say when they go into the speakeasies to see the flapper girls and the Nickelodeons, let's get rocking and rolling. Why?